Um, so John Finley, I am the CEO of Lemonade LXP, which is a digital growth platform for financial institutions and fintechs. Um, so we built the platform because we realized that technology implementations most often fail because all the focus is on the tech and very little is on the people who are meant to use it. Um, and so you guys all face the same problem. You're meant to drive adoption and maximize usage of the technology you're rolling out, but you don't have the right tools to do it. You don't have modern learning platforms that are designed specifically to train people to use digital tools. You also don't have the right support tools to help staff and customers learn to use your tech. <clears throat> so that's where we built our platform. We get brought on by financial institutions and fintechs for a few reasons. First of all, you want to optimize your digital customer experience so you can maximize the ROI and the investments you're making in your tech. So that's one of the main reasons we get brought on. Second one is you're going through a conversion or new tech rollout and you've got to train both staff and customers on that tech to, to again protect that investment. Or you're going through a merger or an acquisition and you've got to get an army of people up to speed on your technology. So those are the three most common reasons that we get implemented. So the platform has two sides, a learning experience side that's designed to engage and educate staff and turn them into digital experts. I'm going to talk about that side, that side for a few seconds. So poor bank staff have been scarred by dreadful compliance training for years. And so we built the main interface of Lemonade's learning environment in the image of today's most addictive mobile and social games. So you start with a tiny little bank and you're trying to grow it into a gleaming downtown tower and you do that by taking training and doing well in it. The, more, the better you do in training, the more customers you earn that helps you grow your bank. I'm not gonna get into all the nitty gritty about the booster game. It's designed to drive participation and keep people coming back to take regular learning, um, um, bite-sized learning bits and it does a wonderful job of that. So when you're training on tech, the first thing you gotta do is teach foundational knowledge, the kind of boring stuff that people have to know in order to promote and support the tech. What are the daily limits? What are the restrictions? All that kind of stuff that customers might ask you. Typically that's been done with a PDF, people read it and tick a box. Lemonade morphs that into a game-based learning experience so it's bite-sized and people play it multiple times. You can see this person did well. They earned 27 customers in that booster game I just talked about. Had they done poorly, they'd have lost customers which means they'd play again. And by playing again, we get the repetition to drive learning outcomes. So it's game-based learning for foundational knowledge. The next piece is we gotta drive fluency. People at banks, uh, bank staff often don't have to bank with their employer. So if they don't bank with you, if they're not using your tech, there's no way they're gonna promote it. So Lemonade has the fastest authoring tools in the world for creating walkthroughs of your technology. And then they can be nested into your learn courses as steps in a course. So you can see this person's taking a walkthrough on mobile check deposit and it's showing them how to get through the transaction. The first time they play it, it has guides. The second time, no guides. Make too many mistakes, you gotta start over. If you do it well, you move on. So game-based learning for foundational knowledge, technology walkthroughs for fluency. The next piece is we want staff to be able to promote that technology to customers. So you can create virtual customer interactions where people come into branch or call your contact center and the job of the frontline staff is to spot opportunities to promote that technology in an elegant way and they get rated on how well they do it. If you don't do it well, again, you gotta play again. So that's kind of the recipe. Lemonade has all its own authoring tools baked in. They're super easy to use and you can create any different types of modules you want and you can curate content as well. The big thing is that it's got the learning methodology baked in and then it's got tools baked in to drive repetition that leads to retention and better learning outcomes. It's backed by a really in-depth analytics package that allows you to attack engagement, knowledge increase, even the efficacy of your content. It's also um, a fully featured learning system. Um, so it's got all the tools of a learning management system, but in a more engaging way. You can create learning paths to guide people through specific courseware to get them to a right learning outcome. You can run contests so that when you've got a big push on this piece of training, you can motivate people, give an extra, order, extra motivation. You can also create certifications, so you can certify people on the technology they're meant to understand and promote and support to customers. So it's pretty powerful in that way. The big objection that you always get when you talk about a new platform is people go, oh no, an implementation, I don't wanna to have to go through that. So we went to great lengths and, and a fair amount of sweat to create the, really the simplest learning system to set up. All we need is a URL. We'll have you live in 48 hours. We have a content exchange, a ready-made content that's specifically designed for the financial industry that you can download into your instance and use as is, or you can tweak it for your own needs. And then it's got the fastest authoring tools in the world. 
Behind me, what you're seeing is someone authoring a walkthrough of how to log into a mobile banking app. And you can see that all they're doing, they've loaded a screenshot in, and all they're doing is dragging and dropping over the areas that they want to add guiding text and writing that in. And when they're done with that screen, they load the next screen in the flow, and they add, the, they add their guiding text again. So this has simplified the process of authoring these walkthroughs. And so this person just authored a walkthrough of how to log in in about two minutes. And you can see when they're done, instantly it's live. And here they are actually using the walkthrough. And it creates two versions. It creates the guided version and then the version that's a game uh, that challenges staff to use it. So it really is the fastest way in the world to create technology walkthroughs. So that's the learning experience side. The next side is the digital adoption platform designed to activate and support both staff and customers. So this is we built to overcome the adoption aversion. Nobody wants to learn new tech using their real bank account. They don't want to make mistakes. Um, and so we built, um, we built a tool that allows you to create an online hub and use those same technology walkthroughs that are nested in your learning courses, but you can put them on a branded, searchable, WCAG compliant hub that people can use in the flow of work. When you're having a challenge with something, you can go and search for what you need and get the, get the help that you need. So these technology walkthroughs are sort of a level up from other ones that you might see in that they're not just a, 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 a light or whatever telling you where to click. It actually gives you the how and the why and what to enter into the fields. So we're driving a bit deeper understanding of the technology that people have the real comfort they need to use it or to promote it and support it if you're staff. So how is it used? On demand, so you can see here, this is Plains Capital's website. Customer comes, is looking for help with mobile banking. They search for it, and it pulls up uh, the mobile banking walkthroughs that are on Plains Capital's Digital Academy. Had they searched for a more specific thing like bill pay, it would have pulled up the specific walkthrough. So self-help for customers on demand. It's also used by branch staff to show customers how easy it would be to do their banking digitally. You can put the walkthroughs on your social pages, and they also help with your search uh, search engine optimization. So if you go into Google and search for a walkthrough, it'll pull that up. It's also used for driving trial. You can pipe the walkthroughs into your product pages. You can link to them from your email campaigns. And for new customers, you can send a curated list of walkthroughs of the most common transactions a new customer would do so they can see how easy it is to bank digitally with you to give you that white, white glove service when they join the financial institution. Um, it's also used for support. Uh, customers, as I said, can find walkthroughs off the website. They can be nested into the chat bot, so it spits out links when, when they're relevant. Also, interactive voice response can send links uh, by text to people. It's also used by contact centers to, um, support, to search for walkthroughs to help customers in the flow of work, shorten the talk time, improve the customer experience. Again, we, to overcome the implementation aversion, this can be live in 48 hours. It has the fastest authoring tools in the world for creating these walkthroughs and updates are super easy for the same reason with those authoring tools. So that is Lemonade. We are at booth 117. I unfortunately have to leave in like an hour, so if you wanna come and ask questions, come by soon. Thank you very much.